Welcome to Drawing Template Basics. My name is Nathan and I'll cover with you what you need to know in order to understand and create your own drawing templates. This is the first video in a series that will cover these topics. First is a general overview and understanding of the template's components. Second is how to customize your template. And third is how to set up your own sheet format. Then we can cover other drawing template tips. Let's get started. There are two components to a new SOLIDWORKS drawing. First and most common is the template. Second is the sheet format. I'll draw a line down the center and we can talk about the differences between the two. First, the file extension for the template is DRWDOT. For the sheet format, it's SLDDRT. I'm going to write intelligent under the template side because it can hold many things such as dimensioning standard. For example, are we in ANSI or ISO? And what units are we in? Is it inches or millimeters? The sheet format can remember things like title block, company logo, and notes on the sheet or in the title block. If I'm to illustrate this, basically the template can remember everything that's under the Document Properties tab when you click on the Tools pull-down menu and click on Options. The sheet format remembers what your paper looks like. Each component or each item has specific functions. The drawing template is used to start a new drawing. The sheet format is not capable of starting a new drawing. It is only capable of adding additional sheets to an existing drawing. Thank you for watching the first video in this series. The next video will cover how to customize your drawing template.